Now, the NBC5 Sports Desk, brought to you by Xfinity. Day two for the tennis state championships and the final day to crown a team championship for the girls. And the final teams in Division I would really be no big surprise as it would be the sixth straight year these two programs would go head to head on the final day of the season. The number one seed Champlain Valley Union, three time defending state champs, first the last team to beat them in a final, that would be South Burlington who had been in the final every year since 2013. All five singles would get the day started along with the number two doubles. The number four singles would finish up first with Renee Dowerman for Champlain Valley versus Raina Purcell for the Wolves. Dowerman would volley the ball back into the far corner for the clinching hit. Hawks take the first team point. After the second doubles would wrap up and put them up 2-0, the third singles got interesting with Callie Useless in the near court coming back to force a winner take all point, but her efforts go a little long, and that gives Kendall Blank the win and puts CBU on the brink of another title. Just across the way, we'd find our fifth singles. Karina Gorman's shot can't be returned. Champlain Valley wins their fourth match of the day, and word would start to spread from there. The title would be theirs again as the number one singles between the Wolves' Kaylee Yang and CBU Stephanie Joseph would also wrap up. Joseph won in straight sets for a commanding 5-0 lead for the team. The dominoes continue to fall into place with the number two singles, where Sophie Dowerman would need to go the distance in her two-set sweep, holding off Sophie Bajold. The only thing to wait on then would be the top doubles showdown, which also went the way of the champs. You can let the celebrating officially begin. Hawks win all seven sets. The last comes on a tiebreaker and makes it a four-peat and full sweep for this year's seniors. It feels great. I know that we all went into it knowing we were playing a really good team and everybody just brought their best tennis. As you can see, the doubles match, everybody just gave their all. And this is my last year, so it was really great to continue the streak. It feels amazing. It's all because of all the practice we put in, all the days we spend just, just doing everything that our coach tells us. And it feels amazing to have it finally pay off. Having this 7-0 really is the icing on the cake my senior year. This is now a four straight titles for CBU. And